today is all about trout. Riley, why is it all about trout? Because today we're doing a uh, catch, clean, and cook. It was so hard to get it that far out. No! Double up. Holy crap. They stock trout in our local ponds here. This is actually Fair Park in Hope, Arkansas. But they stock them in Texarkana, Texas as well, and Texarkana, Arkansas, in Spring Lake Park and Bobby Ferguson Park, the fairgrounds. Extremely easy to catch. We like to use corn and rooster tails. That's a little pink and white rooster tail. And now I gotta be able to get that one piece of corn out there on a salmon egg hook that I got from Walmart, Eagle Claw. That did not go as far as I wanted. Oh, there he is, there he is. But, oh, he missed it, he missed it. Here he comes. Come back, no, no, come back for him. Did you see that? I did, I did see that. I don't know if I got it on camera. Hold on, I'm gonna step back just to... Hey, there's a phone down there too. Oh, there? Phone? Yeah, I do. I might try to get it. Oh, I saw him. There he, is. Bam. Oh, he hit it. No, he's got it. He's got it. Yeah. Oh, no, he spit it. What? Why would he spit it? Oh, boom, he didn't. All right, keep pinching on him. Keep pinching on him. No! He came he's off! He's too small. How you going to do a, a trout catch, clean and cook? We don't catch any trout, bro. All these trout are out here. I mean, I got to hook the only one. What did I tell you? Holy crap, is that a trout? Holy crap, that's a big one. Which side, which side, left side, left side. Bring this way. Slowly. Oh, you're caught on my line. You're caught on my line. Or maybe I've got a fish. Oh, he's fighting, he's fighting, he's fighting hard. Good job. Good job with the net. If you look right here, see his, what is this, the pectoral fin? The pectoral oh, fin not on this side. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. And it's not a fresh one either. He's He's been like that for a while. I'll bring him up to the wall. Don't slip, don't slip. Oh, no, no. Get ready, here he comes. And, oh, there's his dad. Get it. You need help? You take it over the left side? It's not going to be the best angle, but I'm just going to go for it. I don't want to slide down. That's not bad. No Kia. Verizon's the only one that can... Oh, no, 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 no. No. It was so hard to get it that far out. No. <laughs> Dude, I see how somebody lost that and wasn't able to get it. Well, look at there, y'all. Good little find of the day. Got a little SIM card and SD card slot right there. We'll check and see if we can get any information from the phone. Maybe turn it in and find the owners. Hopefully save some footage or something. Maybe pictures that they've got on the phone. That's where I've had it for a minute. Take the one in the right. Take the one in the right hand. I left hand. Take a left hand. Take a left hand. I don't know if I set the hook on this one. I set the hook on this one. Take a left hand. 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 Take a left h
on, double hook. Double hook. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, the camera's not even looking. <laughs> guys, guys, I know you saw parts of that. down in there. That's a nice trout. Hopefully this is going to be angled good. Let me get down here and net him. Just because this is a tiny hook, don't lose any tension on that fish. Pull him on up to the net here, and he's in. Oh, he's fighting him. He's so strong. Okay, he's not, he's not biting on mine. Man, that's pretty though. Is that milk? <laughs> what is that? He's got a string in his mouth too. Look. He's There's a bait in there. Thing. I thought we were gonna do like dissection and see it in the stomach. Look. <laughs> I got Riley for sure. This is serious. I'm going in. That's just using the knife. Oh god. He's crying. It's okay. I got it. Ew. <laughs> Gross. That's in my sink. I saved him. Raffle. <laughs> yeah, y'all saw that. Watch out. Back up. I'm serious. I've cut myself a few times. <laughs> he has. That's where I like to start. Right above that anal fin. Right above the anal fin. And uh, you don't above the anal fin. It's important right now that you don't go too deep because you don't want to cut any of the guts guts deep. open or anything like that because that'll just run some of the meat and you don't want that. But luckily, I have the Rapala knife here. <laughs> I thought it was Rapala. Some people call it Rapala, and then there's other people that call it Rapala. And so I've never heard too no. many people calling it Rapala or Rapala. I'll give you a personal tip. I like to go ahead and finish that cut the rest of the way through. You don't hear Briley right there, the personal Over tip. Here. Boom, and then the throat comes right out with it. That's what you got completed. That's what I have completed. Let's see what Bradley prefers and what he comes up with. That's now, a nice one. Look at that. He really is. Heck yeah. Now, what I like to do is go ahead, run them under a bit of warmish water, really try to work that slime off a little bit. Right above his anal fin. Or hers. I'm not going to make any assumptions yet. Trigger. Now, honestly, for me, that's where I stop. I'll throw him in a bag just like that. I'll go ahead, and for you, I'll go ahead and cut the head off. You but, don't have to. You're cooking it the way you want. That's okay. a, this is on you. Okay. Well, that's, we've got Browley's. That's it. Now, he doesn't cut the head off. He just cuts it out and gets it good. And then we've got mine. So, in comparison. So, it, it's, it, it's in pre personal preference to y'all. Whichever you would prefer. All right. Now it's gonna get to the part to where the cooking part. Now Briley is gonna shine probably on this because I'm not a chef by any means. I but I have been known to dabble a little bit in some seasoning. So mm. all right. So 
Let's get some of this stuff cleaned up, <laughs> and let's get to cooking, Bradley. All right. We're going to clean the rest of these fish first. We'll get back to you guys. Completely forgot bit. about that. Yeah, so time for some hard work. All right. All right, guys. I wanted to show you guys how I personally like to cook my trout real quick. I heat up to 350. While he's heating up, I'm going to take my fishy, my fish right here. I'm going to bring him over here. I'm going to lay him down on this piece of aluminum foil. Work. Okay, just need to grab out a good glob of the butter. Alright. Yes, I use a lot of butter for this. Can't go wrong with butter. Can't go wrong with butter. So what I like to do is rub, have a rub a little bit of this butter. Right on to the trout itself. Right on to the outside of the trout. Then I like to take the rest of the butter. And where those guts used to be, now becomes butter. All right. So. Now, the only thing I need is this right here. Secret weapon for cooking trout. Right there. Best thing you can use in the whole world. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna sprinkle a bit on the outside here. Inside cavity, it's got all this butter in it with some. Sprinkle a little bit more on the outside, and that right there is ready to go, just like that. Literally, all I do now, I roll it up, stick it in the oven, and that trout is now ready to be cooked and throw it in the fire just like that you can put it in the oven you can you know whatever you got to cook with you got one of those little propane camp stoves you can definitely do it over one of those too alrighty folks and it's my turn they are once everything's open and ready we're gonna open this fish up and the first thing that's going in lemon and pepper seasoning you can't have trout without some sort of lemon seasoning. I know that. We're gonna put it on the inside. He didn't know that. He just saw we're me. Put it. I didn't even look at what Briley was doing. He's lying. It's I'm the gonna only throw this spice on here. I took out of the drawer. And see, that's where Briley failed because you need garlic. Everything needs a little bit of garlic. I just put way too much on that part, but it's all right because everything needs just a little bit of garlic. And then. You can't eat fish, any kind of fish, deep fried or not, without throwing it in the batter. Without, Tony's. Yeah, Tony's. That's right. And guess what? I'm putting it all over this sucker. Why? Because it's Tony's. And if you don't use Tony's in everything you eat, you might be healthier than I am. But your food might not be that good either. I will say that. And yeah, y'all see me loading it. Mmm, Tony's. Burn your mouth, almost, <laughs> yeah, just burn your mouth, but we'll go with that. You might need to eat some ice cream. All right, so we're good on all that already. Right. We just want to get butter in the pan. Now the butter's in there. Like I said, two to three tablespoons of butter. Now the pan's calmed down and all right, which is exactly the way I always do it. Not really. <laughs> I don't cook, like I said. So I'm probably doing a bunch of things wrong, but guess what? Hey, I don't care. This is gonna taste awesome. I normally don't cook it for about three to four minutes on each side, depending on how it looks. I guess we're gonna find out. And of course, once you get a good layer of butter going, you're gonna wanna throw in a little bit of your olive oil. 
kind of like kind of dilutes it a tad bit dilutes your booter actually I don't know why you do it but you just put a little bit in there I'm not gonna put much either enough to mix it on in there mix it on good Set that sucker down in there. Oh, you're still washing. Here you go. Good job. And we're going to let it cook for a few minutes on each side. And we'll be done with it. Like I said, I'm no professional, but I can tell you one thing. This smells pretty good, y'all. This smells really, really good. I'm gonna dig a piece of this off right here. And I'm gonna see how mine tastes. Here we go. All in. <laughs> okay. All in. Okay, let me try his. Let me try his. Or let me try his. Oh my god. Earl, I'm sorry. Okay. Bone in my mouth now. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Bunch of bones. Alright, here we go. Not bad. Same, same. His isn't bad. Oh, 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 yeah, right. Yours is kind of gamey. I like the natural flavor. That's why I like to keep it simple and just use the lemon pepper. Trout, because I like the... Trout does have a natural flavor, but I'm sorry. Ooh, this right here. Let me tell you. Mm -mm. You gotta be careful. They do have bones. So, his, mom... Success, success either way. Awesome little catch and cook we did. First catch and cook for the channel. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that go. Um, I'm sitting here just chowing. My chowing. I need to hurry up and get to mine chowed down. Camera's probably about to die anyways. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. It was a lot right, of fun. Send us out, brother. All right. Remember to like and subscribe. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram. And uh, just to let you guys know, a little heads up. I've got a bottle video in the works. Chester, Illinois. It is the home of Popeye, the sailor man. So that's pretty awesome. Great find in this video. Wish I could have went. I'm super jealous. Yes, y'all. Drop us a like, comment, subscribe. Let us get a, a spot to go fishing if you're local. Hey, if you're not too far, we might travel. But give us a whoop. Give us a whoop.